Hello creators! Today we're starting a brand new motion graphics title series, where you will learn how to create quick and easy motion graphics titles. In this tutorial, we will design a smooth and simple title. So without any delay, let's jump in and create our first title. Here I will create new composition with time duration of just 20 frames. Now let's create a solid background layer. Add fill, and we will set color for background layer. You can set any color of your choice. Now let's create the title area. Here you need to add the dummy text. Now make changes to the text as shown. Now let's create position keyframes for this text. Create in keyframe. At start, adjust the position value slightly. Select keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease and adjust the speed graph. Perfect. Now let's add the character to the middle. Set the font size and align the text to center. Now for this text, create scale keyframe at 10 frames. Create keyframe for scale at start, reduce scale to 35. Make sure anchor point is set to center. Select keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease and adjust the speed graph. Perfect. For dummy text, change track mat to alpha mat text. You can see the preview. Now let's create another title layer. Now add the text. Make required adjustment to the text. Adjust the text size. Position it to center. Set anchor point to the center. Now let's animate the text. Add tracking to the text. Add in create keyframe for tracking. At start, Adjust tracking amount. Select keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease and adjust the speed graph. Perfect. Now let's add the position property. At 10 frames create position keyframes. Now at start, adjust position as shown. Now select keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease and adjust the speed graph. Perfect. Now add the fill effect. Set the color of background layer. Now add shift channel. Change take alpha from to full on. Now add CC composite. Now add fast box blur. Here you can adjust the blur radius. Place it above fill. This affects the background of the text layer. Set iteration to 1. 
you can see the preview. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. See you in next tutorial with another awesome title.